Welcome guys to another episode of Hunger Games, and we're on Corny's account again, because as I said, I'm like, I have like an hour. I gotta, I gotta do everything, it's gonna be amazing. Hmm. I have no idea what to talk about. I actually have decent topics, but I just didn't like research them enough to have any idea what I'm talking about. So I guess we're just gonna murder people like normal. Boop. Just hit him in the face with an axe. Well, in my culture, hitting someone in the face with an axe is actually, uh... It's polite. If you don't hit someone in the face, it's actually pretty rude. Oh, fuck. Shit. Shit. A sword is very rude. It's, uh, when you hit someone in the face, sword... When you hit someone in the face with a sword, it's very rude. But hitting people with an axe, it, it's a sign of respect. Because you think they're, um... High in vitality or whatever the fuck healthy means. There we go. I'm gonna hit them in the face with a sword because I'm rude. Alright, so I'm... Oh, there we go. There's pants. That's... Ow. Ow. Alright, so he got hits on me, but that was when we had res 3, so it's only like he got one hit. Ooh hoo hoo! He did not expect the turnaround. I'm very fond of that tactic. I can't say that I invented the turnaround, because that's ridiculous. It's literally turning around. You can't fucking invent that. But I, one of the things I don't see a lot of people do that I like to do is, you turn, it's just when you turn around. You turn around, oh shit, this guy is way more gear than me. Ah, uh, 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 how did I live? What? I don't just, I, I don't feel like I deserve to live that, survive that fight, but I did. So you know what? I'm, I'm reaping the benefits. So... Half armor bar always better than prop one. How did all of these speed pots show up? What the hell? They're everywhere. Let me go check out middle. Someone's gonna block this, but you know, just in case, just in case. Well, let's, let's get some speed two pots just for walking around without wasting the speed three ones. Does anyone directly guard in the middle? No, we could just we could get a free sharpness enchantment. We don't really have the health to take on anyone right now, but you know. I mean, we can't go around upgrading ourselves. The hell was I talking about? I have no idea. Oh yeah, the turnaround thing. Um, I, you should turn. One of the things I like to do is turn it around, right? Oh shit! Oh, oh, the fuck? What's going on? I like turning around right, bef right after we get hits. Because, um, there's a lot of reasons for it. Oh shit, that guy actually has gear. I do not want anyone to get access to this. Do I have TNT? Yes, I do. But TNT might knock the other TNT and make it worthless. Nah, it's, it's all good. That's my video. You can hear it finish processing. I'm recording while rendering. I think I can, I can, I can get enough FPS. Oh, turn around. Battle of the century! Please, creepers, don't mess up my speed! Oh, oh, should I hit a ledge? Oh, but it didn't matter. I could have gotten caught on that ledge. It was sloppy. Oh, I have 90 TNT. Wow. A lot of group damage. We have really nice armor. Ah! Um, I'm good at video games, as you can tell. Just Let me just... There we go. I'm sure I saved half a heart from that. The fell was Oh, yeah. Turn, turn it around, like, right when people get their kits. That's one of my little tactics I like to do, because... Um, it's risky. It's risky as shit. It could go wrong, but it's like, it's it's just like, it's pure. Yo it's <laughs> at the risk of sounding exactly like the teenager I am. It's pure yellow mode. That's all I can say. It's it just fucking. You throw all your. You just go all in. It's an all in maneuver. I mean, the second they get their kit, you just turn around and just barrel through them. It even works when you're like really low on health because they don't expect you to turn around and since resistance 3 just ended suddenly your hits are going to be doing more than twice the amount of damage their hits were doing earlier like two and a half times and they'll probably be putting on the armor from their kit and suddenly you can just fucking wail on them. Especially effective on high level kits because they have so much to put on and usually you can get a free combo off of that and a free combo right after res 3 ends that often changes everything. Just, just the little things I like to do, you know, you build up little strategies over time. I like strategies. A lot of people, and I, I, I don't understand it, I 
something that I have used constantly and I don't really see a lot of people doing is I turn around before doing potions. Or even using a bow. I turn around before shooting a bow sometimes. Although you guys don't see that very often. Like them. I'll just go like... You, you can't stall me. I, I have speed 3. Boop. 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 Welcome to hell! I got an... I got... Quest completed. I just got a crap ton of experience. Welcome to hell. That's the Mega Walls Blitz quest? Yeah, I think it is. Certain it is. Yeah, I, I, I just build up a lot of really weird PvP strategies over time, but I, I think... I don't really think they're weird. I think they're just little basic tricks that you can do. Like, if you turn around while drinking a potion, or if you turn around while doing something that slows you down, they can't see what you're doing. So, for example, in situations where getting a bow shot is very important, someone's charging at you, I just turn around, and then I flick around and shoot them before they can realize I'm holding a bow. Although, honestly, I don't do that much in Blitz. I don't get an opportunity to. And also just drinking potions so they don't know what potion you're drinking. And you can fake potion a lot better. What? Where are you? Uh, I don't... I don't know where you are. Sorry. But yeah, let's play another round. All right, I'm playing Kalem because I haven't learned from my mistakes and I keep getting fucked by high-level kits. The first round it was, so let's see, what was it? It was a Horse 10 who had a full heal potion. The second round it was me cornered between a Creeper 8 and a Red Dragon 9. And the third game it was just me getting killed because I tried to take on someone who had max gear from high-level Creeper Tamer off spawn with like three armor bars. And in my defense, I got him to one heart, but it was just too much armor to handle. I don't know. I, I, I just feel like if someone gets more hits, they should usually win. Especially when it's such a difference as it's been recently. Like, I'm okay with kids giving, like, you know, maybe a one or two hit differential, but it's, it's a bit large recently. Way better than Mega Walls, though. Oh, are these two people teamed? Because one of them is a stone sword, another one has decent weapons. And this guy looks like he wants to interrupt just because he knows I'm winning, which would suck. Mm -hmm, I'm, gonna get, I'm gonna leave. Bye. Why do I keep getting rubber banded? I don't like it. No, I'm not gonna team. So we won the spawn fight. Not that it's worth anything. We got a little solitary pig man. It's a nice mob. It's a nice mob. I like it. It's a bit fragile, but it's nice. It's a little nice counter to some of the really high armor people you'll encounter pretty often. Sure, I need to extend my speed buff. Ooh, you have actual... Oh, shit. I turned around at the wrong time. Oh. That was fucked up on my part. I got stuck rotating between... Uh, I don't know what to call them. Uh, point of view perspectives? Uh, third person? Or I don't know what to call it. I got stuck hitting F5. So we have speed potions. We do not have sharpness on our sword. And I suspect XMLG is a high-level kit, so... At least we have Scout 1 and Pigman 1. You know, we got the combination of level 1 kits. Level 1 kit combination overpowered. Really would like a enchantment on my weapon, though. Is there a free enchantment bottle in here? Someone might have left behind? Nope. Okay, I guess we just wait for someone to approach from over here. Someone has to be coming soon, right? Probably someone right on the bridge. And it's exactly who I thought it'd be. Alright, he is Slimer Slime 9, I'm predicting. At least a decent level of slimy slime. Ooh, he's got a bow. What does he? Should I completely imagine that? Mm, yep. Mm, yep. Mm -hmm. Oh. And that went a lot better than expected. Damn. Oh, shit. This guy thinks he can janitor me. Nope, nope, not in a million years. Nope, nope, nope. I'm gonna I'm on roll. Actually, you can. You'll, you'll be completely fine. There's nothing I can do. But still, I'm happy. Oh, please, no. I, I don't want to deal with so many people in a row. What? Please don't get horse generated. Please don't get horse generated. Please don't get horse generated. No! 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 Oh, 
thanks. Ty. Please let me heal. Oh, he died. <laughs> Thank you, Blitz Gods! <laughs> I, ki I killed him with one. Alright, this is... This is what happens when you're a disciple of Bread Road. Nothing but good luck, nothing bad ever happens. <laughs> the fuck happened? I, I had, like, the awesome fight with that guy, and I was low afterwards. I'm like, oh, God. The eight block. I, under I understand. I understand the struggle, MLG. Happens even to the best of us. Yeah. I think MLG was victimized by the amazing eight block powers. No, it's just part of Blitz. It's, it's, it's not even part of Blitz. It's part of PvP. People notice it in Blitz a lot because it's speed PvP, and it happens a lot in speed PvP, because speed PvP is all about momentum. And so if you get long reach, the momentum will make your reach even longer. Honestly, I noticed it in potion pot PvP. I got for some reason potion PvP sound. It rolls off the tongue poorly, but pot PvP. Now, now it sounds like drug PvP. I think drug PvP is a thing. I once saw a faction server that was literally just, just advertised that it had drugs. Wow, I have a lot of ADHD. The hell was that conversation pattern? It was like, it went from blitz struggle to reach to pot PvP to fact to drugs to faction. What? I'm I'm not a normal person. Like, that was another episode of Blitz. I there's no chance of me being able to cover any of those topics. So I'll take up another five minutes in the lobby. See you guys next time. Bye.